London's Empress Hall sees the climax to the week-long Conservative Party conference when 10,000 delegates give a rousing ovation to their leader, Winston Churchill. Accustomed as he is to receptions such as these, the Tories' grand old man is obviously deeply touched by the fervour of his followers. Commenting on the coming general election, Mr Churchill outlines the right road for Britain, as the Conservative policy has been named, and says... We have all been uh, kept on tenterhooks about whether there would be uh, a general election before Christmas and about when we should be graciously told. <laughs> Can Britain, in the past to which she has been led, or has uh, been brought, <coughs> afford to spend three or four or five months manoeuvring about to party tactics and electioneering with a parliament which is not only dead, but decomposing. <laughs> but there is one thing which I want to make clear tonight, above all else. And that is the position of the Conservative Party whenever the election comes. We are not going to try to get into office by offering bribes and promises of immediate material benefits to our people. We will do our best for all, without fear or favor, without class or party bias, without rancor or spite, but with the clear and faithful simplicity that we showed in the days of Dunkirk. Yeah, yeah.